The retail industry is on the verge of a pivotal shift as the world is shifting towards e-commerce and online shopping instead of traditional offline shopping. Even though shopping centers still hold the lion's share, the COVID-19 pandemic and social distancing measures have forced retailers to adapt, promoting an even bigger emphasis on delivery and online shopping. 20 to 30 percent of the Egyptian workforce work in the textile and garment industries in as many as 15,000 factories and workshops, half of which are women earning far less than $2 per hour. Over the past decade, these local manufacturers have been losing tremendously to international fast fashion brands, which caused a spike in the unemployment and a wave of workshops going out of business, mainly because they couldn't keep up with the new market shifts like modern designs, customer ever-changing taste. They couldn't grow the retail or adult digital. They simply failed to compete. Opie took the lead into reviving this industry and enhancing the local taste of fashion. What OP does is that it bridges the gap and reconnects the manufacturers with the end consumers. With our updated trendy designs, profound marketing knowledge and strong e-commerce experience, we helped setting new standards for the local production to compete globally and bring back to life a dying industry. OPU is a digital native vertical brand. We were born online. We design, curate, market and distribute our own products. We connect directly to the customers and own the entire customer relationship. By controlling the whole process from ideation to the customer's doorstep, we bypass middlemen and avoid sharing margins with retailers. This makes our margins four times higher than traditional e-commerce. Today, fast fashion became more like a commodity. It's even more complex in the fashion retail industry, which is crowded and rapidly changing. Most apparel retailers try to differentiate themselves through lower prices or faster shipping. At Opio, our differentiation is customer experience and personalization. Shopping is a very personal activity. That's why we leverage AI and data science to deliver personalization at scale, unlike the traditional brick and mortar experience. We want the Middle Eastern women to be fully proud of their wardrobe, so we created a versatile, high quality and sustainable clothing line that makes our customer look and feel their best. In a market where technologies, systems and products are easily copied by competitors, we are driven by emotional aspects. Opio always encourages the idea of customer centricity among its staff. Most companies focus too much on the base instead of focusing on going the extra mile for a customer. Accordingly, we thrive to add what makes us different from our competitors to build brand loyalty. Starting from assisting our customers through chat services all the way to handwritten, personalized notes, scented products, free surprising gifts, and more. We also speak the language of our customers, which gives us an edge among international competitors. In a nutshell, we are always keen to deliver the wow effect by adding a personal touch which makes our customers feel favored, spreads a positive word of mouth, and creates a memorable experience. We at Opio focus on the variety of content and variable styles of presentation in order for us to reach a wider target audience. And since our customers are at the heart of everything we do, we love to help them style our products in so many different ways with a fresh and vibrant looks by giving them inspos, ideas and inspirations on how to wear our products in so many different ways. For example, turning a day look into a night look within the same outfit. We also like to give them a sense of rejuvenation in their life through their final look, targeting their sense of change through our products instead of only just focusing on selling the product itself. Opio leverages on the boom of digital adoption that resulted from the pandemic. That's why we're always striving for more. We're currently working on solidifying our presence in the Egyptian market and plan to be operating in six markets in the coming couple of years. We believe that we can make it happen. We are at the right time and we have the right team for it.